Hey there peeps, welcome to the channel. I am Parky P and today we are playing more Hellblade Sinnoh's Sacrifice. In the last video we fought off the plague in the second trial of Odin and uh, actually died a few times, which means the rot on our arm has, inc well, it's pretty much doubled, which is not good at all. But today we're going to carry on and finish well, at least finish the third trial of Odin. Again, depends how long it actually takes. If it's a little while, then it will be a video on its own. If it's a nice short trial, which we've no idea, then I might try and get this last trial included as well. So let's see what the trial has in store for us. A king in the north forced the dwarves to make a sword that would never fail and never rust and that would slice through iron and stone and bring victory to its bearer. But the angry dwarves cursed it. It would be the death of a man every time it was drawn. And it would be the death of the king. Let me tell you about the sword Tyrving. I don't recognize this place. Where are we? Where is she? Oh, we're on a beach. Where are we now? This is nice. Burial mound. Burial mound. So strange that we go to such a place. What's over here? Something so very ordinary. Or anything? Okay, so we can get up here. No answer for it. Um, but when it comes, the Ooh, look at that landscape. Wait, so the tree's only over there. Then comes the reckoning. So are the trials actually visible from the main island? Ooh, hello. Shiny, shiny. Oh, this isn't going to be fun. Secrets? No. Any secrets around here before we enter the pit of death? No, no secrets. Oh, <laughs> I'm not looking forward to this. You've probably discovered by now that I'm quite the wuss. Especially when I can't actually see, and I know you guys can't actually see, what's going to be in here. Why are the walls melting? Hello? <laughs> Jeez. Oh, literally can't I'm see. Here. I'm here for the trials. Like when we first met, remember? Dillian? Dillian? What's wrong? What happened? Can you hear me? How can we get to him? Just wait there. I'll find you. How do we? Is this just a maze then? <laughs> just gonna keep doing circles. Can I light this? I can light this. Okay. Speak to me. Tell me some stories. Anyway, you remind me of a story that the Northmen tell about a young woman warrior. Her name is Herva, the daughter of a berserker born after he was killed. She's a wild, willful child who teaches herself to fight with weapons. When she learns where her father is buried, her only desire is to reclaim the treasure buried with him, but above all, the sword, Tyrving. Ooh. That voice doesn't sound like What's happening? It's not him, it can't be. It doesn't sound like him anymore. What's this saying? Herver disguises herself as a man to join a band of warriors and soon becomes their leader. When they come to the island where her father is buried, her men do not want to go ashore. They say that evil haunts the island and that it is a worse place by day than other places are by night. Fearless, she lands alone. There are many grave mounds and all of them have ghostly flames burning over them. She comes to the grave mound of her father after passing through these ghostly fires 
as though they were mist. The flames I passed through were real enough. Damn the Northmen to hell. Damn the Northmen. Within the burial mound, Herver calls on her father to wake from death and bring her his sword. She says that it is not seemly for the dead in their grave mounds to bear valuable weapons. Her father answers with words of warning. You go to your doom. Baleful runes surround you. You have gone mad. You have lost your mind. Your thoughts are confused. It is dangerous to wake the dead. Like I said, she reminds me of you. <laughs> oh, and there's the sword. Okay. So we're going to have to... We're at the root. We're going to have to go... Left, right, left, right, right, right. Right. Now we should get to the sword. So left, right, left. Right, 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 right. Definitely getting louder. Oh, and then there's a little passage here. Okay. So, oh god, this poor voice. That voice, it's not Dillion. That's not Dillion. Let's light the candle and then it should be right again. Yeah? Hello there. Dillion wants me to face my fears. This looks like it's promising. Senua. Father? I'm leaving. I've decided. I think it will be good for me. Oh, Senua. It's the darkness. It's speaking through you. No, Dad, it's me. I think I can beat it. In my own way. I can see the darkness in your eyes, child. I met a boy. Boy? The chief no. He said he could help me. It's a trick. He said I could be normal. Normal? Yes. No boy is going to save you. No one can. This is when they see the rot growing no. inside you. No. They will turn their back on you! The gods can only fix you through my hand! You're going nowhere! Everyone's chastising Senua because she's got no. mental illnesses. You will not defy the gods! Oh, God. Senua. Come, child. Take my hand. Um, then what? No! I am leaving! You cannot escape the darkness. Your curse will make everyone suffer. You will have blood on your hands! Okay, so that's the third trial done. Um, we're going to carry on, we're going to get the fourth trial done. Uh, yeah, I feel so sorry for Senua. Every time you remember, it disappears. 
Hello, last shard. Last trial of Odin. What do you have in store for us today, Mr. Odin? The Northmen say that their all father, Odin, gave his eye in exchange for a drink from Mimir's well, the well of wisdom. In blindness, there can be wisdom. Only by giving can you receive in return. For this reason, I give my life and pass on my stories of the Northmen to you, Senua. So what? Where am I? Wait, what? So, are we not going to be able to see in this one? I'm right here. Can't you see me? Oh. Help me. Breathe slow. It's the darkness. Stay still. Empty your thoughts. Uh. Tell me what you feel. A breeze. Good. There's then literally there a way out. nothing here. I can't tell where it comes from. Yes, you can. There it is. There's the breeze. Yeah, there's a breeze coming from over here. Okay. The, the voices. So gone. again. Um, I'm still here. I've said throughout the whole series, really, that this so is the best experience with headphones. So dark. It's okay. Listen to Definitely for this breath. point. Feel it rise and fall. Good. Is this way? Be aware of everything you hear and feel. Let your senses guide you. Yes, we can just about see now. Is this our house? I don't know what's inside. Don't be afraid. Jump. Do a flirt. Oh, no, she fell instead. Dylan, there's something in you. Do you see it? No. Then it cannot see you. Quietly move past it. One step at a time. Um, so I've got to move past it. Oh god. What the hell is that? That's something else entirely. Jesus Christ. That's so creepy. Is it moving? So I assume I can't go that way. There's a chain there. God, that's so, so creepy. Can I walk fast? Please? Okay, so I've got past it. It's not following me. Leave it behind. My God. So where am I going now? A well. There's a well. Jump down it. Don't turn back. We're getting oh, close. we're actually going down the well. The light. Oh, there's more Please. of these bloody creatures. Help me. Oh, 
let's avoid the dead people. And just move forward. Avoid all those. Let's not even focus on them. Let's just keep going. So is that Dillion over there or is it just the moon? Is that you? Oh. Yes. I can see you too. Yeah? I'm coming, Dillion. If that truly is you. Dillion? Oh, let's run. Hello? Dillion? Please? Oh, you. You disappeared on me again. She could spend hours, days even, trapped within herself, in the dark. Oh, I did not like that one. You see me? Yes. Your eyes were open, but you were... gone. And when it finally let her go, she could be anywhere. With no memory of how she got there. When it comes for me, I have no power over it. But here, for the first time, someone was there to help. But I heard your voice. Oh, God. You brought me back. I'd hate you to be in a situation like this. All you needed was a little help. A little hope. My God. This is so intense. I feel so bad for Senua. I know how hard it can be with mental illnesses. Uh, I'm having my own struggles with mental illness right now. Not the same types, but... God. Into the halls of Helheim and challenge Helheim. Anyway, let's get this sword and then we'll end the episode there. And the sword will lead me to oh, Poor Senua. It'd be horrible to just literally lose days at a time because you don't know what's going on or where you are. And to hear all these voices. I'd this is truly a stunning game. I've not felt this connected to a character in so long. I, I can't even think like off the top of my head which type which character I've had such a connection with. Um probably Lee and Clementine in the Walking Dead Telltale games, but this is something completely different. Come on, Senor, you can claim this sword now. We've defeated all the trials of Odin. To pass the warrior trials. And she saw a way out. To leave her past behind. And become a warrior. In Dillian's clan. Go back, go back, go back, go back. The sword is tainted by the gods of darkness. Leave it. No. You left it here. He wants me to take it. You will pay a price for this. Um. But years later, oh God! With Zinbal's parting words still haunting her, the darkness came back with a vengeance. The plague. Dillian. Everyone suffered. Oh, My father was not supposed to die like this. <laughs> so am I, Dillian? Do you see it clearly now, Senua? The suffering you've caused. This is your fault. <laughs> you no. brought this plague to us. <laughs> you have blood on your hands. We're okay, Senua. We're okay. 
They're coming for you now. They're coming. They're coming to get you. Oh, we're in for a fight then. Let's see what this sword can do. Come on then. Oh god. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh god. Okay. And yeah. Yeah. No, let me dodge. And again, I'm getting too, like, just trying to do these heavy strikes. Oh god. Sea of corpses. The corpse waved through itself over the ones I loved. The ship broke up under them. The ship All these hands. Sailed from the land of shining fields. There are well, the hell the our hands going on right now. Come not here in the sun. All right, let's just run Come through. not with a sword. This Come is such a strange over a naked visual. Come not with disturbed mind. What's that? Like? This isn't your fault. My God! Do you yeah, hear the fight again? Sound? Does your precious gift of sight let you see the souls that rot here in this sea of corpses? Do you feel the blood running cold? Okay, so it's a lot easier to defeat you. Hear their endless cries. Do you smell their putrid wounds? They were once yes. Lost. Sisters and loved ones. Come on. You have done to them. Come on. We've got this. All because you were a coward, because you banned from your curse instead of facing it. When you turn your back on the fathers, let's go, Sinawa. Turn your turned your back on the gods, and let the darkness wreak havoc on your people. Why must they pay for your heresy? Oh, that's a big boy. But we've got this. We've got this. Uh, no. That's cheating. Get up, get up, get up. Come on, Senoa. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I died. I died. Yes. Oh. Who is it? Galina. Love her. Love her. She calls for you, Senoa. Go to her. Answer her Where pitiful call. Oh, Senoa. 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 That last fight was fantastic. You both surrendered to the Your dear beloved mother was powerless against the darkness when it came forth. She too had a sight. Come on, Senua. She too doubted the gods and let the darkness infest her. But she didn't run. She escaped the only way she knew how. She gave her life to the gods. Let's go, Senoa. The world would have been spared this horror. This is not it's my not fault. Come on! Come on, man. Oh, let's not do that again. Get up, Senoa. Get up. Come on. Come on. Come on, Senoa, please. Yes. 
Come on. What a tap tip we've got going on there. Oh, no, 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 no. Get up, get up, get up. Come on. Come on, Sir Noah. Yes, okay. Brilliant stuff. Come on. Yes. Too ahead of ourselves here. <laughs> oh, dear me. Okay. Oh, there's more of them. Come on, Senoa. That's not fair. It's nearly over. I can't see. Come on, Senoa. Yes. No, 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 no. Come on. Got it. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yes. Come on, please. Go, Sanoa. Why do you still fight on? I'm pressing dodge. Come on. Into the seas of the rivers of hell. Isn't that what you deserve? Give the dark. Let's keep going. No, that's not. No, come on. Just look around here. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Come on. Come on, Sanoa. Let's keep fighting. Fight me! Come on! Yes, Senoa! Oh God! Come on then! That's not fair. Fight me! Yes. We've done it. Okay. Let's keep going. Keep. Come on. Come on, Sonoa. Let's get out of this corpsey sea place.
No, we're not giving in to the darkness. We are both dead. We keep going, Senua. We keep going. Jesus Christ. We've got this, Senua. Let's keep going. Is that Galena, our mother? I can't fight it anymore. Not on my own. I want to be with you. Ah. It's okay, Sonoa. It's okay. That night, she gave up on her world to follow in the footsteps of her mother. To go to a place where the darkness couldn't reach her. Senua, look at me. Please, Senua. Do you hear them? They're calling for me. We've lost so many. And I've lost my father. I can't lose you. You said it. I have blood on my hands. I didn't say that. You've done nothing wrong. Zimba was right. Everyone will suffer. Zimba is a fake. He is a hateful, bitter liar. He's poison. And his words still haunt you. Who do you trust? Him? Or me? You, Dillian. Do you still believe in me, Senua? I do. In us. Come back to me. Please, come on, Senua. Please. <laughs> Don't let this darkness come between us. <laughs> You'll be okay. The hardest battles are fought in the mind. He gave her the sword with which to fight in more ways than one. And she gave him her word never to surrender. We don't she surrender with no help. help. A little hope. What an episode. R r very intense. I'm going to leave that one there for today. We're probably approaching the end of the game. If not in the next episode, probably the one after. Uh, I've been Parky P. If you've enjoyed the game, make sure to leave a like on the video. Comment what you have enjoyed, but also what you haven't enjoyed. And most importantly, hit that subscribe button. If not for me, for Senua. But hit that subscribe button for more Hellblade, more Senua and more content from me. Once again, I have been Parky P, and I shall see you all next time.